I'm Andrew Aaron, your tour guide for this art tile journey. This is the final part and the longest part of this series, so please find a comfortable chair. The tiles we made previously are fully dry and will go in the test kiln for the bisque firing. At this stage, the tiles can be stacked directly above each other. They will not stick together. Test kiln is ideal for small batches because it's faster to reach full temperature and faster to cool down enough to open safely. After about nine hours in the kiln, the gray clay has become a bright white clay body. I'm going to use a speckled glaze on these two tiles. I've learned that five coats of this glaze works the best. Because I make tiles and not that 3D pottery stuff, I can use a foam roller to apply the glaze. I will once again use our semi-patented number technology, keep track of the coats, and I let the coats dry completely before applying another. the deeper areas, I use a brush to be sure that glaze covers everything. While these visuals aren't changing too much, and because so many people asked about it after part one, I'll soon perform my favorite song ever, arguably the greatest composition of Western civilization, Strangers in the Night, just as soon as the lyrics are downloaded. Check the sides to make sure that glaze isn't dripping down too much. I just decided that I'll turn one of these tiles into a unique object, an art art tile. After the five speckle glaze coats, I'll use a slip trailing bottle. which I've filled with a nice translucent peach glaze. It's peach colored, not made from peaches. Only one coat is required when using the slip trailing bottle. The glazes will dry completely and these two tiles will go into the test kiln. I'm using tile setters because they keep the tiles from touching each other or any parts of the kiln. This firing is the second and final one and will take about four hours. The next day, when everything is back to almost room temperature, I can remove the tiles. Well, this is the conclusion of the series, but please, I beg of you, do not take these tutorials and go making your own tiles.